Here comes the boy. <laughs> well. Hey yo, rich cat check. Meow 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 I am spoiled kitty. I'm a kitty who takes everything for granted. I love you, dog. Go watch it. Post the video that made you go viral. So I read on the internet that cats uh, get on your laptop because they're mirroring you. And so if you get them their own laptop, they'll leave you alone. And look at this little business. Put this sound over the last video of your cat. If you're seeing this, ask yourself, have you ever seen a brown cat? You are so beautiful to me, can't you see? This is me as a potato, but look at my cat as a potato. That time my cat kissed a mouse and left it so confused, yearning for love. Good night. Love you. What's going on? What's going on? What's happening? Did Ivar try to get in here? Oh no. Oh no. Toad, it's okay. Tell me. It's okay. I'm gonna get that's it for him. He's in a lot of trouble. My happy, happy guy. Oh, just a happy, happy, happy guy. Oh, just a look at that. A happy, oh, the happy dog. Oh, just a happy, happy, happy. Hey, what are you doing in here? <laughs> New trend. Kiss your pet on the head and see the reaction. Do it two times if you're a human trapped in a cat's body, okay? Two times. <gasps> if Michael Jackson is still alive, press down three times.
Hey, baby floof. Come to me. Come here. Bye -bye. You come here. Our master Claw chooses who will go and who will stay. I have been chosen. Farewell, my friends. Hi, can I get a medium iced coffee and everything bagel toasted with extra plain cream cheese and a side order of bacon? Look at his tail. He's asleep because he knows he has to go to the vet today. I'm not buying any of your BS. Let's go. Chase. Chase. Come on. Let's go. Let, let's go. So this morning, my cat was like screaming a bit and it woke us up and we're kind of freaked out and it's because she had a baby. We didn't even know she was pregnant, mama. We didn't know you were pregnant. She's so tiny. My cat getting impatient while waiting for me to turn on the faucet. <laughs> I feel like the sweetest and purest of all life forms has to be men that love cats. Because every other guy's like, yeah, I love my dog. Like, yeah, dogs over cats. Cats suck. And then cat guys are like, yeah, I like both. And I like my cat a lot. Here's some pictures of my cat. And then it's like pictures. Every morning, my cat begs for me to do her makeup too. Watch how happy she is. You're so pretty. Yeah. Okay, you want some blush now? Some blush? Oh, yeah. Oh, my goodness. You're so beautiful. Uh-huh. Yeah, a little bit right there. Mm-hmm. So beautiful. So beautiful. When his voice doesn't match his face. Dude, are you okay? Do you do you know how a door works? Are you 
Here are five secret messages your cat is trying to send you. If they show you their belly, it means they trust you. A slow blink translates to I love you. Peaked ears and a flicking tail means the cat is aggressive or on high alert. Cats meow to imitate human speech, and meows have different meanings. A chirp means hello or I missed you. A lower pitched meow means I'm hungry or bored. Kneading or making biscuits means your kitty is comfortable and content. Oh, come. She'll find this big mess. And this mess is so big. Are you serious? It's so deep and so tall. We can knock it. Dude, you just ruined our fort. Your fort, really? Yeah, it's story time for us. Oh, wow, with the cats. Yeah, it's our favorite book. Oh, too. I'm so sorry. Let me just fix your little fort here. Okay, guys, we're going to leave off. Watch my cat fake a limp and then switch paws. Again, honey. Come here, Mr. Pitiful. Oh, good. Oh, what happened, baby? Honey. Oh. I would like to see the baby. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god! I'm not like... I feel like no one believes me. This is a real thing. Oh, oh, oh my god. Oh my, okay, there she goes. Like, what do I do? Like... You've heard of cat with a hat but have you heard of cat as the hat ah ha ha um i don't know what to do when this happens like we're both stuck here like she's clawing my head but like i can't remove her because she'll claw my head um ah! summer don't you think the babies are getting kind of old no you want to keep feeding them? You sure? You don't have to. I give them food every day. Oh my god, who walks like that? I made a friend on my way to work. Hi! It's so nice to meet you. Hi! Why do you walk like that? Who taught you? You're really cute. Oh my god. I gotta go because I'm gonna be late, but I love you. Bye. Phil, there is a tiger in the bathroom. Careful, don't go. What? what are you doing? Oh. Oh. This is the prettiest cat I have oh ever god. seen. Did she say hi back? Oh, oh my god, you're so, you're so beautiful. Hi, you look like a tiger. <laughs> So I'm taking care of this cat. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's a really good point. And um, so they have an automated cat feeder and it like drops like on a schedule and the cat knows the schedule, but she got here early. <laughs> and she's so mad that it's not dropping. I know it's going to drop soon. I don't know how to speed it up, but it'll happen. Oh, God.
You're my friend now. Oh. oh. Hi, little fella. Oh, do you like me or something? Loki, hey bud. Come on, I gotta go. Come on, you forgot. Come on! Here are five secret messages your cat is trying to send you. If they show you their belly, it means they trust you. A slow blink translates to I love you. Peaked ears and a flicking tail means the cat is aggressive or on high alert. Cats meow to imitate human speech, and meows have different meanings. A chirp means hello or I missed you. A lower pitched meow means I'm hungry or bored. Kneading or making biscuits means your kitty is comfortable and content. This is a good way to start with the dog. Is it a cat? You know, you know what that dog wants, the butt. Show him the butt. You know that he needs to sniff it. Nope. Yeah. They're the same color, so they have a lot in common. Yeah. <laughs> He's like, I don't know. <laughs> Hi, such a sweet kitty. While cats don't meow to communicate with other adults, they do meow to communicate with kittens. So why would a cat use a sound that is exclusively used for kittens to communicate with you? Some researchers think that a domesticated cat's brain doesn't actually register you as a different animal, but instead views you as a cat, specifically a kitten, because they don't see you doing any cat-like behavior. And this can explain a couple of other things too. For example, if your cat's ever rolled over and invited you to pet its belly only to attack your hand, this is actually a way that cats teach kittens self-defense. If you have an outdoor cat that's brought you a dead animal, some people will think that's a gift, but it could be the cat is either trying to share its prey with the other cat in the house, or show you how to hunt. Basically, your cat thinks you're a big dumb cat. Bestie, your toes smell good. What was that? I think it was just a human. Let me nibble your toes. Why on earth would I let you do that? Because we're besties? I didn't know cannibalism fell under the bestie qualifications. Please, stay back back, I say. You can run, but you can't hide. Six months ago, a stray cat showed up on my doorstep that we called Boise. And he's always lived in the garden and never really liked being indoors unless, of course, he's getting food. But since getting him neutered, he's slowly been spending more time in the house. And one day, he even curled up on my lap and started purring for the very first time. And over the coming weeks, he's got more and more confident when staying indoors and even started to explore further into the house until he found his new favorite sleeping spot right where I normally sleep on my bed. And when Boise sleeps, boy, does he sleep. He now spends all day in my bedroom and even cuddles up with us to watch movies at night. It's got to the point where he actually hates being alone and if I leave the bedroom for too long, Boise will come and stare at me until I return so that he can go safely back to sleep. The only problem is I still have to let him in through the back door every day, so it's time to give him a key to the house, which means grabbing and bagging him while he sleeps for another trip to the vet so Boise can get the microchip he's always deserved and we can register him on our cat flap and teach him how to use it for 24-7 entry. And there you go, Boise is no longer a stray. He has officially become part of our family, although I do worry that he's getting a little bit too comfortable on my side of the bed. I thought I heard meowing. Oh my god. Hey. Hey, guy. And I was right. Fucking, I came prepared, huh? He's still meowing. Hey, bud. Not even fighting or anything, she's so sweet.